I'm Makia Wright. Continuing from last week, we're at Juntendo University, which has a more than 180-year history as a comprehensive health university. The university's Health and Sports Science School is located at the Sakura campus in Inzai City, Chiba Prefecture. And here they offer three courses in sports science, sports management, and health studies, allowing students to learn about sports scientifically and from a variety of angles. We continue with our tour of Juntendo University now. The university is known for producing numerous athletes and coaches and has been focusing on developing new talent. And in recent years, they established the Japanese Center for Research on Women in Sport to support women athletes. With me is the Executive Director, Etsuko Ogasara. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. What kind of activities does this center carry out? We're carrying out four projects now. The first is research into the physical conditioning of women athletes. We're carrying out research together with gynecological and health and sports science experts. The second is research into women's physical strength and health development. The third is research into the relationship between athletic performance and genetics and environment. I myself am leading the fourth, which is research into women's leadership, promotion of inclusivity. We cover a broad range of fields. How do you see the environment for women athletes now? In terms of top level high performance and Olympic level athletes, I think the environment is very favorable. But if you look outside that group, I believe there's still a lot of room for improvement. What kind of activities will the center carry out in the future? We're currently carrying out research, not just in Japan, but with colleagues overseas and from other institutions. We've made tremendous progress in terms of joint research and hope to further strengthen our international collaboration. The development of women athletes and researchers is something I really look forward to. Thank you for today. Thank you. On this big campus, they have a range of facilities, such as an athletics field, soccer and rugby fields, and competition halls. They say there are many club activities, including a women's soccer club. Would you tell us about the university's women's soccer team? Our team members love sports, and many enter the university with the desire to learn about the various aspects of sports. Some students want to enhance their competitive abilities, while others are interested in injury prevention and training, or hope to become instructors. A key characteristic of our team is that it's made up of students with various goals and motivations. I imagine the individuality of each member is an advantage. Exactly. We also have many experts who can support them and help them improve. How have they fared as a team? Every year we compete to make it into the top division, but we haven't made it yet and are still in the second division. It looks like you've played before. I have. I was the captain of my university soccer team. Is that so? Why don't you join our practice then? There's no way. I'm sorry. I appreciate the invitation, though. 
I see the team members practicing now. What kind of training method do you use? Technique is naturally important, but our training is focused on improving communication among members and decision-making abilities. I was at university about 20 years ago, and it seems there have been a lot of advancements in sports. What's unique to Jutendo University? With the support of the Center for Research on Women in Sport, the students practice with a GPS device on their backs, which collects data, such as physical stress and how fast they're moving. Using that, we optimize training for individual athletes. We asked the members about the attraction of the soccer team. Everyone plays while paying attention to what other members are doing. I think it's a place where we help each other develop our game. The senior members are very thoughtful and can be strict at times, but we can play soccer at our own pace. I'm sure we've been seeing some future stars and coaches in the making here. Today we introduced you to the Japanese Center for Research on Women in Sport at Juntendo University and learn about its women's soccer club. Hope you enjoyed it.